Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lisa Mapsy here with Do Mapsy Gang, Mapsy Mafia. You know how we do, we stay slick with it and I'm back again with another video. And today is different. Today basically a lot of you guys requested my YouTube setup video and to be honest, I don't even think my setup is all that. To be honest, it's really simple. I think this video will help you guys. I'm also gonna um, try and list down below where I get everything that I use for like filming and that. And basically try to be as informative as I can for you guys. And yeah, to be honest, um, there's not a lot of introing that needs doing. However, um, after I've shown you guys a basic um, tour of like my filming area or my filming corner, if you wanna call it. Um, basically, I'm just gonna sit down and then I'm literally gonna just talk about my setup and why it works for me, how it works for me, and also like cheaper alternatives and stuff like that. So um, yeah, let's just get right into the video. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe um, to my channel. It helps me out a lot. And yeah, let's get right into the video, guys. Um, to be honest, for filming um, purposes, because obviously I've only got one camera at the moment, I'm gonna film on my, on my um, phone, like my setup. I don't think it should be too bad. I've got an iPhone. Oh, I've got an iPhone 8 Plus, so I feel like it should be okay. Um, and I know my top looks weird, yeah, but I'm wearing a bra with it because I just didn't want it to be too much like nips. So, oh okay, yeah, cool. So from where I'm sitting, I literally just flip the camera around. In front of me, this is what I see when I'm filming. So I have um another mirror right here. Hold on, let me just show you guys my desk area. So my desk area is literally my laptop, um, a bottle of water, my makeup brushes, um, you know, a mirror. And then this is my Reiki, Reiki, Reiki loves Reiki um, vanity mirror. And I'm going to show you guys how it sort of works. So basically, this is not sponsored, but I'm just showing you guys how it works. I accidentally burnt my desk there, but we're going to fix that. So you can open this to different um, widths, whatever, whatever. So cool. I usually put it quite high up because I like to see myself straight on. And then it's not charged right now, but this is it when it's off, as you can see. And my ring light is on right now, just to give you guys a bit of lighting. But when I switch it on, I might do a whole video on this. But I can put, as you can see, it's on one right now. It's meant to be on three. But let me show you how bright it gets that's how bright it gets i'm going to also show you it flips around what it looks like so yeah that is my reiki mirror it's also got bluetooth so you can take selfies without even standing there and then let me put it back down so yeah let me switch off cool and um, this is my hp monitor my camera with my 18 is it 18 inch ring light and yeah my laptop is here this is where i do all my editing and stuff on and i always have a bottle of water with me because it gets so hot here and yeah as you can see it's a big three window window so i get all the sunlight in when i'm filming during the day and yeah i'm just gonna stand up now and show you guys what it looks like like if you was to walk in my room and see my setup so yeah so guys this is my set don't mind my um mcdonald's cup and don't mind that yellow lamp because um I'm gonna talk about that in another video. <laughs> but yeah, this corner, I've basically got um, nothing here at the moment. I haven't got anything in that corner. I usually put my ring light and wig head there when I'm done using it for the day. But I'm just gonna move it out of the way just for the purpose of the video so you guys can see the full space. So we're gonna move it. So yeah, this is literally my setup. Um, as you can see, my camera is here. You can't see anything on here because I have got the micro is it the micro hdmi cable that connects it to the monitor that's right there as you can see it's really really hot <laughs> but yeah cool so this is my little desk space i have this battery charging thing so i can charge two of my i've got three camera batteries in total so i charge like two at a time so it's ready for when i'm filming i also have my sony speaker it lights up as well so i have that here as well because 
I usually listen to music or even when I'm watching stuff on my laptop, I like to connect it to my speaker. Probably wondering what this is. That is underneath my monitor and this is for my mirror. So basically it's got two magnets on the back and if you literally go like this, you get zoomed in. Okay, I look crazy right now. But you get a zoomed in perspective. This is when I'm doing like my brows or like eyeliner, eyelashes, stuff like that. And this is also a phone holder. So I can, it can stretch, as you can see. It's so dirty, I'm so sorry guys. It's got makeup all over it. But as you can see, just goes on there like that. You put your phone in, I can go on Instagram Live. I can also film, you know, those short Instagram videos that people do. So I haven't done that yet, but I can do that. So this is really handy. This mirror was like 200 pounds, which is really expensive, but yeah, it is worth it. So yeah. Let me show the rest. And I also have a charger on here. It's my two meter um, iPhone charger because right there I have an adapter. So basically it can reach all the way up to here. So even when I'm on live, I can charge my phone, which is perfect. So yeah, this is literally my background, the famous background. It's nothing special. I just try and make it look as nice as I can. So I've got a shelving unit from, I think it's from Little Woods. So there is literally, I've got a bag and it's got more like tools rollers things like that then i have my slippers there that i just feel like inside the house all my friends come over and then here is literally all of my hot tools so my straighteners curling tongs hot comb what 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 and then here i'm actually not sure what i want to put here so i just put anything random because i just had a spare shelf i'm gonna figure out what i can put on that shelf but as for now i've literally got boxes of like some gifts and stuff in then I've got that box that I can just put in some random stuff that I need to like use whilst I'm filming. I've got a pair of shoes and then I've got my little, um, then I've got my Balenciaga box. So because I liked my, I wanted my background to look really cute, simple and just chic. Um, obviously here is the main things that I use when I am filming. So I always have my heat protectant, I always have my hair mousse, makeup removal, banana powder, fix plus um my rubadescu um some extra lashes there and then i also have my vanity planet um skin cleansing thing i usually use the silicone thing because sometimes brushes can break you out if you do not wash them properly so yeah and then here i just have my dior backstage little shopping bag then my little dior bag that my lip glosses came in so i've got the lip gloss and the lip maximizer i prefer the lip maximizer i'm not gonna lie guys it's basically a lip gloss but without the shine and it plumps up your lips so yeah here i just wanted it to look cute so i put my perfumes here um these are just the ones that i really really like i've got this like in my wardrobe this is basically for stuff that i just like how it looks do you get what i'm saying the other stuff is like put away in my wardrobe but i've got you know my perfumes and whatnot my fancy foundation i don't even use this like, it's just there for sure because it's too dark for me and it oxidizes really orange so yeah got the wrong shade so yeah cool and then here is this is i think this is the shelf that everyone likes the most like these two shelves that's why i put them at the top so when i'm filming these are the two shelves you can see so i literally got a louis bag but in front of it i put my little bracelet and i really like this because it's like you don't need to have like big like designer things for it to look nice you can literally just have a small little piece like this same with like my chanel perfume it's just like a cute little perfume to put in front of the bag and then the pandora um bag for my little ring box and then my other dior bag but then i put my chanel um highlight and contour thing here i don't use it all the time so i just leave it there um and yeah up here is i just put heels i put black clear and gray because that's that's literally all the colors that i wear see i've got boots there then i've got these heels then i've got obviously everyone's got these heels <laughs> literally everyone and anyone has got these heels so yeah i've got those and then i've just got these ones that i wear all the time they're literally the most comfiest heels i've got and then up there i've just got a few bags i wanted to mainly do it like black up there so these are basically like my black bags but obviously that one's checkered um not checkered but it's got that material on it and then i just put a big flannels bag up there but that's actually storage so it's actually got so it's actually got loads of other stuff in there like loads of other little bags and little accessories and stuff that is literally the backdrop basically obviously my bed and the headboard is there but you guys only really see up to there so cool 
now let's get on to this perspective of things so the monitor that i've got is the hp monitor i'm not sure which one exactly it is but it's literally silver and it's just it's very thin if i go to the side hold on it's literally this thin so it's a very thin monitor sorry my airpods are there <laughs> So yes, a very thin monitor and I think it was like a hundred pounds or 117 but I literally use this to see myself because if you can see my camera it doesn't flip all the way up but the thing is I really like the quality that it gives me it's just a little bit better than the Sony A5100 this is the Sony A6000 and I just like it a little bit better and um, this um right here obviously that is the charging um port but this right here this is a micro hdmi cable that connects direct from my um from my camera and then if you see this cable right here obviously i can't really yeah okay so there all the way to my monitor so this is literally what i use to see myself to make sure everything looks right to make sure i look in focus and yeah the ring light that i have is the new is it the newer i don't know but you guys know that you know got it on amazon and it is the 18 inch one i have got the white you know the things that you clamp on to like dim it a little bit and i've got the orange ones to make the lighting a bit warmer but it works perfect for me like this and it works really good with my background and then another thing that helps with lighting in my room is my big window <laughs> window so um all the time the sun sets right here and it goes all the way around the house so what i usually do is i take um i film now i film um during the day so i film during the day and then um at night time or like late afternoon i go and take the pictures in my mom's bathroom which is on the other side of the house and the lighting is always banging there you guys already know all my insta pics are taken there and yeah that is basically my setup it's nothing special it's literally a corner of my room i'm looking to get the big um you know the ikea storage like drawers i'm trying to get them there so i can like organize like right now my makeup is like oh guys my makeup <laughs> everything is a tip okay everything's a tip i'll sort out those drawers but yeah this is basically my filming setup for you guys that really wanted to know and yeah it's pretty pretty simple um i don't really have any settings on my camera i literally just put it on this setting so i think this is intelligent auto so it's auto but just a little bit better and yeah you don't need to do anything it does everything for you you can choose how much you want it to focus or defocus and yeah guys that is literally my youtube setup and yes i'm gonna go back to my seat and we're gonna talk a little bit about it and wrap up the video um, as you guys have just seen in the previous clips, I was just showing you guys a little tour of what my YouTube setup looks like and yeah, how I film my YouTube videos. So um, I don't really have that much to say because it's more of like what you guys can see, but my setup was literally not expensive at all. If you take out like the mirror because you don't need a 200 pound mirror, I only got it recently and it's only because... Of the lighting so guys I decided to put my phone on the um on the what you call it again on the mirror and I'm gonna show you guys how bright it actually goes I'm gonna switch off my ring light <laughs> hold on <laughs> switch off my ring light and then we are going to press the on button so this is the minimum amount of brightness you can get on it and if I go up one But yeah, um, yeah, so I can go, this is level two, three, four, five, six. I think it's five or six. And look how good that lighting is. Like, if I really wanted to, I could actually film my YouTube videos on my phone. And I know a lot of people who are starting YouTube film their videos on their phone. So if you don't have enough money to, like, get a camera and a ring light or anything like that, if you really want to, you can invest in this mirror which is i think it's like 190 pounds i'm not sure how much it is in dollars but yeah i'm gonna check it's like 190 pounds and it comes with um the thing where you can attach it's bluetooth take pictures videos so you can start off by going on live on this like i go on live on this um you can also film little mini tutorials like instagram tutorials and look it spins around 
all the way around so it's really 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 good i would definitely um i would definitely recommend it but you do not have to do that if you um want to set it up like my setup with the um with the monitor and stuff you can do that as well and to be honest if you've got a camera that's got um the tiltable i don't know what you call it viewfinder or whatever it is like where you can see yourself you probably don't need a monitor i only use a monitor because for my beauty videos i want to see like oh does it look right is the color off is that off like what does it look like on camera what are you guys gonna see on youtube watching it so yes um this is literally what the lighting looks like so yeah so that was me basically talking about the mirror and if you guys should invest and um, the company is called Riki loves Riki and yeah it's you know I saw um Jasmine Brown um using the mirror in one of her videos and she said she travels with it and stuff like that and it's literally like an iPad you can put it in your suitcase you can put it in like a big bag if you have one and just take it around with you if you need it if like especially me getting ready in like hotels and stuff it really really pays off so yes um as i was saying before you do not need a super 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 expensive camera i'd say a perfect camera to get your first camera is the sony a5100 because you won't need a monitor and also it's much cheaper than the one i've got i think you can actually get one on amazon for maybe 400 pounds or 390 something like that sorry the mirror just switched off <laughs> but yeah something like that so you can just save up a bit of your coins get the camera and then you're literally ready to go so i hope that helped you guys and yeah do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in my next video bye guys